Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of EDI Doors. Uh, today it's going to be a new little thing I'm trying to do. Um, I'm actually going to do a bait making plus a fishing uh, little series. I'm going to take the baits that I make and the colors I make, go out and fish with them, hopefully try to catch fish with it. But today's episode, we're going to do June Book coming right up. Y'all want to see this? EDI Doors. Alright guys, like I said, um, we're actually about to go out. I have some June bug worms that I made a few days ago. And a buddy of mine that I work with um, actually just put an order in for some June bug worms and some June bug creatures. Alright? So when you order my baits, the uh, creature baits, they come eight per pack. I'm actually going to hook them up a little bit, give them ten per pack, come give them two of each creature mold that I have. So we're going to do a real quick June bug. June bug is pretty simple. Uh, you, it's like a purple. You can do, you know, your blue and your red mix, or you can do a June bug colorant, which is what I have, and green flake, lots of green flake. And it's basically it. The worms I have inside, I'll show you guys the worms whenever we're done. But right now, I'm gonna do some creature baits in June bug, and um, yeah. And then this afternoon, it's finally clear, clear finally for the next few days. So I'm just fishing, and I'm gonna go out in probably about an hour or so. But for right now, let's go ahead and knock these baits out. Alright guys, as you can see here, I have all of my creature molds laid out. We have the big Ragnarok right there. We have our Menace Hog. We have our mini miniature, or miniature Menace Hog. Our Zydeco Bug. And then this bug here, I don't have a name for it yet. If you guys go below, give me a, a suggested name uh, for this here creature. It's a 4 inch. It's the Kevin Van Dam uh, Beaver Tail style bug. Um, Whoever names this bug, um, I give you guys a free sample. So go below, drop a comment, let me know what you think this should be called, and uh, help me out naming that. So I have all five of them here laid out, and before I start, I like to take a little bit of cooking spray, canola oil. Just it helps get everything in and out nice and smooth. I just like to hit my molds with it. Gives it a little bit of shine, and also, like I said, makes it to where it comes out of the molds. Pretty easily. So uh, my plastic saw is heating up. Check it out. Right. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Plastic saw is heating up. Um, we're going to get set up. You ready to make this color? Won't take long. All right, you guys. Get everything clamped up. Let's check out plastic. It may be looks like it's looks like it's about ready. Check that temperature. 333, not quite, we need to hit 350. It needs to be right at 350. So put it back in, give it another 45 seconds. That should be ready. So in the meantime, let you guys see what we got. We got our June bug colorant. They don't plastic June bug color. And then we have uh, big green, medium green, and miniature green. Green flake. June bug. All right, you guys. I'm having to try to work around this camera, so y'all bear with me. We're at 356 degrees. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Uh, try to adjust. All right. So, start off with our colorant. I'm gonna do uh, start with 20 drops of our June bug. Alright, we're at 20. Give that a swirl. That looks pretty cool coming to life. Very, very transparent. So let's do another 25 drops. That's about, that's, yeah, we'll go with that. We'll see how that looks. Once we add our flake, it's going to darken it up a great deal. So we'll see. You can always add to it. Can't take away from it. So we can always add a little bit more colorant after it. So we're going to start with our big green flake. Do one full scoop. Medium green flake, one full scoop. By the way, this is one cup of plastic saw. I don't know if I mentioned that earlier or not, but. And our miniature green flake, we'll do one full scoop. 
It's actually small, that's not miniature. I have some miniature that's like literally tiny, tiny. And uh, we'll see how this looks. It may add a little bit of the miniature. And just like that, the June boat came to life. There we go. That's a June bug color we all know and love. Drop that color and jump on over and get going. Perfect. So put the rest back into the into the mixture. Oh yeah. Left side. Run number one. All right, you guys. Let's go ahead and unmold these real quick. Let y'all take a gander at what we got. I'm just gonna lay them all out real quick, and then uh, we'll look in depth in a second. All right, we have our big menace hog right there. So you gotta see them here in a second. Ragnarok. Baby menace hog. Zydeco bug. Oh, that's pretty. I like that. And then our contest named creature. All right, you guys, got them laid out here. We have our big five and quarter inch menace hog brush hog right there. We have our four inch baby menace hog. We have our four and a half inch riding rock right there. Our Zydeco bug, four inch right there. And then our contest name creature right there. All right, that's June bug. Very, very green. Uh, it's all green, actually. So, toss these aside, let them start cooling. We're gonna make one more run, and we'll be done with that full order. All right, you guys, got them laid out here. Actually went and shot a few uh, swim bait while, while I was at it. So I got those there. It's a little ripper, fast buster swim baits. Anyway, so we got a creatures laid out. Those are the worms. Looking pretty. Yeah, we'll let those finish curing and marker. All right, that's it for now, you guys. Thank y'all for watching and tuning in for Media Outdoors. Um, gonna do a little bit of fishing, a little bit of fishing tonight, and hopefully catch a few. I'll see you guys next time for Media Outdoors. Media out.